Hi, me again. Um, just going to be showing you how I use this stripping block on my gem wire pointed Charlie. So he's just licking away at his um, peanut butter on the side of the unit. So let's get on with it. I'll show you what I do. So Charlie's used to this now. We've been doing this since he was our baby. He's now nearly three. He's totally used to being groomed, touched everywhere. Makes it easier if you need to take them to the vets as well. If you used to be handled this way. So what I do, if I see any um, kind of coat, if you can see it, sticking up, you can hand strip it if you want to. I find that quite difficult because I've got um, osteoarthritis now in my hands. So hand stripping is a bit of a no-no for me now. So I tend to keep on top of the coat. Obviously, I'll do the other side in a bit. I tend to just use this and um, a stripping knife as well. Um, he's used to be going and doing this on his legs. Don't forget, when they're babies, just do it really softly and gradually, get them used to it. Um, and eventually, they will let you just groom them everywhere. And it just makes life so much more easier. Um, I don't tend to do it all in one day. I'll probably do one side today. Tomorrow I'll flip around and we'll do the other side. I know there's probably people out there going, oh, we shouldn't be doing this, but I've always done this to my dogs. Um, and it's always worked. I never put them on a table because um, I had an accident years ago where one of them fell off. So I've never done that again. So I'm quite happy just sitting on the floor doing it and you get a little bit more up close and personal with them and if you're not strung up with a lead on a, a grooming table and they get confidence in you doing it you're confident in doing it everybody's happy and they get to lick this peanut butter the peanut butter that I use is from Aldi and it's a smooth one and I pierced it in the licky pad put it in the freezer and it's there whenever I need it really I'll probably do the other half tomorrow but when you're doing puppies just do a little bit just get them used to it a bit at a time just do very softly give them encouragement make sure they're licking something I mean they don't it doesn't have to be peanut butter they can whatever the dog's like but if you're using peanut butter again don't use peanut butter that's got palm oil in it because it's quite toxic for doggies When they get to about this age, they will let you groom them, do the nails, as I've got in another video. Hopefully it's not too wobbly, the video. I'm holding it while I'm doing it, because you, you get a better look when you're a little bit closer said with the camera being miles away there we go if you want any more advice or um, if you want help with anything just send me a, a message and I'll try and help but that's me done for today I'll do a little bit more tomorrow hey Charlie all done hey all done yeah okay I think we're done bye bye